Good morning everyone, Hormaker here. Now, <sighs> another disappointing season again for the Dallas Cowboys. Damn, guys. I don't know what the heck Dan Quinn is doing with the whole bull crap that's going on. Damn. How embarrassing. You know they lost by 16 points? It would have been by 8 points if they, if they would have made a late touchdown. But, oh, oh yeah, yeah. And I know you guys gonna start playing PK. Oh, look, it's deck. No, it can't be deck, guys. Yeah, I can throw pick, two picks. One should have been passing difference for the defense. The other one was pick six, pick six. So, yeah. Yes, the. Yeah. Anyways. Nothing to talk about. I need, uh, let's talk about the best stuff. Yeah, the whole turnover and everything. Like I said, if you watch the film, one was well, one was a dad, Dougie, and the other one should have been pass interference. But of course, the referee didn't call that shit. But remember, Green Bay. You may beat us, but Karma will get after you. You'll see. So yeah, that's the the defense could have stopped shit. And I'm like, oh yeah, yeah. How embarrassing, guys. The defense couldn't stop shit at all. So I'm like, ah oh, yeah yeah. So yeah. The positive is is that Hey, the rugging was getting better. That first got through for 404 yards, three TDs, two interceptions. It would have been a four TD. But yeah, right now it's super cold, guys. So that's why I like I'm start. Uh, yeah, I don't know if you guys can hear me like sh like shivering and shit because it is cold now. And this is what I'm talking about. So yeah, it always has to be the defense, guys. Jesus, no matter how it will draft well the Dallas Cowboys do, the defense is always the problem in the playoffs. <laughs> ah yeah yeah. I just hope Jerry Jones just fires Mike McCarthy and and then Quinn. Cause those guys <laughs> but I'm seeing that some Cowboys friends they say like you know what let's just give Mike McCarthy one more chance I wouldn't mind but I saw Jerry Jones not up to us but uh, who knows who knows but yeah it was 32 to 48 the Packers were shitting uh, bricks when the Cowboys were making a comment like holy shit It was like 32, 48, and it was 32, but 48. <laughs> then I'm like, wow, that's crazy. It's the, yeah. I was like, holy crud. It would have been super sweet if they would have make if they would have recovered that onside kick, and they would have quick score. It would have been. 40 to 48 and they would have recovered another onside kick it would be awesome 48 to 48 <laughs> but uh, it, it's okay it is what it is with the whole Dallas Cowboys nothing you can do life moves on so yeah Let's see if it's true that my, my Michael Parsons is going to go with Dan Quinn. I'm like, huh, good luck, dude. You're going to need it if you're going to be with Sookie ST. I'm like, the offense? Last year was the offense. They couldn't, like, move the ball. Deppert was throwing with the interceptions and everything. And this year he proved everything wrong. Proved us wrong and everything. And then the offense was better. 
this there. Um, I'm like, oh yeah, yeah. Well, let's see what happens first. Let's see what happens during the off season. Free agents. But anyways, anything can happen, guys. What is this? But alas, anything can happen. I'm like, a lot of surprise moves. It's like they say about the whole offense. Like they say, okay, all oh, the Cowboys are gonna struggle without Kellen Moore, and look what happened. Number one off. And here say Dan Quinn leaves. That's the um they say oh okay they're gonna struggle with Dan Quinn without Dan Quinn and then poof they end up being better. Hey I could be right, I could be wrong, but hey I'm heading, I mean, I'd rather be positive than negative. Embarrassing, yeah. But I'm not gonna, uh, like, bitch and won't get, oh, no, okay. Okay, that is this, that is that, no, okay, yeah. Tantrum, no. I'm not, I'm never gonna say, like, I'm, like, oh, you're never gonna see me it's, uh, don't throw a tantrum or anything. Hey, no. No. Now you're gonna say that because I know you guys are gonna expect me to do that shit, like get all tantrum and shit. No. Not me. But yeah. Uh, who knows? I expect a strong off season, guys, for the Dallas Cowboys. Expectations, but yeah. But yeah. But who knows? That has meant end up hiring a new head coach, a better defensive coordinator. Hello, Dougie. So, yeah. And a better everything. But at least anything can happen, guys. Let's see how the offseason works for the Dallas Cup. I just hope they don't bring back Dan Quinn. But if they do, like, ugh, here we go again. We're gonna have a great season, but in the playoffs, ugh. It's gonna suck. Yeah. Huh. But let's see what happened today in the Philadelphia versus the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and then the Steelers and Bills. But who knows? What the heck? What the heck? So, yeah. I just can't wait to start doing the walkthroughs already, guys. I'm still halfway to the Prince of Persia Warrior Within. I, I do have part three. I do have access to it, but I haven't finished it. But what I'm doing right now, guys, is that I'm playing my newer games that I hear say Switch games, Wii and Wii U. So that 
you guys can be like, oh, okay, so he's doing this, he's that. But behind the scenes, I'm doing like the GameCube walkthroughs. I mean, GameCube game, so I could be like, oh, look, guys, I just finished this one, let's go. I just finished this one, let's go. So, yeah, still a long way to go. Well, who knows? Who knows? What the heck? So, yeah. Let's see what happens first. Yeah, what a beautiful weather. At Laredo I already broke the record. The lowest it was it was thirty degrees, but in the morning it was like twenty seven degrees. So it might end up breaking records. So yeah. Have a good one guys. And always go cowboys. <laughs>